Parkinson's disease is a neurodegenerative condition that affects predominantly a part of the brain that makes dopamine. While the average age of Parkinson's disease onset is in the mid-60s, it can affect adults of all ages. Some examples of early symptoms can include handwriting that's become smaller, difficulty manipulating objects such as keys or buttoning up the shirt. Treatment options for Parkinson's disease include lifestyle changes, prescription medications, and surgical options. While lifestyle changes and medications can be effective for a good number of years, for some patients, the next option to consider is deep brain stimulation surgery. Deep brain stimulation involves placing electrodes deep in the brain and connecting those electrodes to a pacemaker device. That device allows us to fine-tune certain parts of the brain that are abnormal in diseases like Parkinson's disease. Deep brain stimulation is used in patients who have previously responded to medication and is certainly not one of the initial therapies that we use for Parkinson's disease. Patients who receive a diagnosis of Parkinson's disease can expect to lead a full, normal life with appropriate care. The OHSU Parkinson's Center is a world leader in research in Parkinson's disease. All of the neurologists at OHSU's Parkinson's Center have had specialty training in the care of patients with Parkinson's disease. In addition to our neurologists, our comprehensive team includes physical, occupational, and speech therapists, nurses, physicians' assistants, and research assistants who all have an expertise in Parkinson's disease. One of the things I like most about my job is the relationship that I form with my patients and their families over a long period of time.